welcome to NLC Live Devo with Lauren and Emily. Uh, this episode is brought to you by Elevation Conway. What up? Um, we are the college age community yes. at New Life Church. So if you're in Conway and you're in college or you're college age and you're looking for some really cool friends, we want you to be our friends. We do. It's true. Come Hit us, us up um, on Instagram, Elevation underscore score C W Y. Um, that was good. That was good. I think that was a lie at the end. <laughs> Seriously, let's get into the word. Are yeah. you guys ready? That's why we're here. Come on. Um, what's the word today? What's the word? Today we are in Psalms 26, 11, and it's with David talking to God, and the verse is, I am not like them, Lord. Not at all. Save me, redeem me with your mercy, for I have chosen to walk only in what is right. That's good. So just to be real, whenever I got this verse to do our Devo on, I was like, wait. What? I was like, wait, what? Um, it wasn't super straightforward. I had to do some digging because I was like, this could go a lot of different ways. Um, but the topic we're going to focus on today is righteousness. Yes. And we asked on social media what you guys thought righteousness was. Mm -hmm. And we got um, a, a few couple. answers. Yeah, so what are our favorite answers? So our favorite say? answers were right living with God is something righteousness Shout is. out to Jade Moore. Amen. What up? And then Sophie Davis said, God being the only righteous one covers us in it yeah. to give us guidance, morals, and virtues. Yeah. So... David, I, I took this as David was like crying out to God saying, I'm living this blameless life, so please make me right with you. I'm living blameless life, make me righteous, but that's really not how right. righteousness works, no. right? Mm -hmm. How do we attain righteousness? Well, the closer we get to God, right. the closer we get to his righteousness right. that gets put on us. And ultimately, our righteousness is attained through Jesus. Mm -hmm. So Jesus took on sin on the cross, and now we take on, we get to be sons and daughters of Christ because right. Jesus died for our sins. So we are made righteous only through Christ. So nothing that we can do can make us righteous. Right. So that's why it's kind of like, what is David trying to say? Like he like he doesn't understand the concept, hello. Um, but yeah, I, I love that David's being emotional. Right. And like he's telling the Lord, yeah. like, this is how I'm feeling at the time, which is good. I love that mm -hmm. people in the Bible are real about right. what they're feeling at the time. Yeah, and I can, I think I can find myself being that same way. Kind of right. like, oh, I read my Bible all day, all the, all the days, yes. <laughs> every day this week. <laughs> um, and so because of that, um, God approves of me, yep. um, which is not right. God gives us the word of God and gives mm -hmm. us the ability to worship him and pray. Um, to him for us it's not for our own righteousness we can't earn our righteousness right. um it's all and, for god's glory right and so i'm actually studying the beatitudes in matthew 5 right now and one of them is blessed are those who hunger and thirst for righteousness for they will be filled and what i love about that is that it doesn't say blessed are the righteous it says blessed are those who hunger and thirst for righteousness right. meaning all you have to have is a desire to do what is right, to live a blameless life, live with integrity. All that the Lord cares about is our desire to do so because he knows we're going to make mistakes. Right. And, um, and but, he loves David's heart in this. Right, right. He's not condemning David for, for thinking, oh, because I'm living this blameless life, I'm going to be made righteous. Um, and so Jesus is enough for us. His mm -hmm. grace is enough for us. Um, we can't do anything to change that, um, which is awesome but until we learn that i feel like we can't really have right. um as much of a relationship a true relationship with the lord until mm -hmm. we understand that you can't do anything to change um where you stand with god yeah. um because he loves us he sees we are made right in his eyes he sees us blameless and without sin because of jesus um and so what we call that whenever we start to think like faith what did you say earlier faith faith by works Yes, we don't have a works-based faith, yeah. basically, that we don't have to ever arrive or ever do enough to attain righteousness with the Lord right. or be part of his, right. be daughters and sons of the king. This is what David's saying, basically. Right. We've learned so much digging into just that one word that you right. see so often in the Bible. So we just encourage you that like, when you're confused about a word or you don't understand like a 
theological concept like righteousness That's good. to dig in and look yeah. it up and ask people. Right. right. Um, and then one last thing. So I love, we're just going to go a little bit further. I love in verse 12. So after David's crying out, um, God, show me mercy. Um, I'm living this blameless life. Make me right. It then says, oh wait, one more page. Um, verse 12, it says, my feet stand on level ground. In the great congregation, I will praise the Lord. And so what I took from that is our righteousness isn't just so that we can be like, oh, peace of mind. Like right. I'm, 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 the Lord sees me mm -hmm. um, as righteous, cool. Uh, but it's so that we can understand the righteousness so that we can in turn praise him yep. for his righteousness. And so um, I just love that. But anyways, we're gonna pray and then we'll head out. Um, God, thank you so much for today. Thank you for every person that's listening in. God, thank you for sending your son Jesus um, so that we could be made right with you. Um, God, I pray for each and every person that they would understand the greatness um, of, your, of being made right with you. Um, God, and in turn, we can have a relationship with you through Christ um, and we can experience true righteousness only through you. God, I pray that as we go throughout our day, that we would remember that we can't do anything to change our relationship with you or the way that you see us. You already see us as blameless um, and without sin. We love you so much in Jesus' name. Amen. Bye. <laughs>